What's happening, y'all? It's your boy Q Monster here, back at it once again. Alrighty, I know I am kind of late, even though this mug was posted four days ago, and I forgot all about it. Um, like I said, I had my reasons, you know, so, I mean, hey, it is what it is. It is what it is, but I know I'm late, and I do have a reason why I'm late on this uh, topic news. But, um, yeah, so it seems like we finally have our Katana, you know, character that's going to be showing up in the Mortal Kombat 2. And they finally found an actress that can play as Katana. So, uh, let's go ahead and see what's going on, who they got, who they got that's going to be playing as uh, Katana. Uh, what about, well, hold on. By the look of this title, it's uh, Andaline, Andaline Rudolph. That's what it is. And the line Rudolph. I don't know if I'm saying it right. Um, yeah. Let's go ahead and check this mug out. Has another significant casting that we can talk about today, right ahead of the start of production. So let's talk about the fan favorite Katana being played by the star, or at least one of the stars, of the recently canceled Netflix Resident Evil. They need to slow it down that resolution. It's not gonna work. So this news was originally and exclusively reported by the Hollywood Reporter, and they were the ones who confirmed that Adeline Rudolph would be playing oh, okay. Katana. Now Adeline she's Rudolph. known for a couple of things, mainly two Netflix things. One, the recent Resident Evil, which was canceled after one season because it was just kind of awful. Not as awful as you probably might have heard, but it's pretty terrible. On top of this, she was also in The Chilling Adventures of Sabrina, which means that she's joining, once again, one of her co-workers from that, Hadi Gabriel, who was recently cast as Jade. So clearly, they kind of know what they're looking for in terms of talent and uh, you know how popular the stars are. And well, here we are with the casting of Katana. I know what you're thinking, because I saw this brought up. Hold up a second, but Melina, she was clearly played by a person of color. So, since these two are related, what? Well, two ways to look at it. Either the story isn't complete, and or they're just going to ignore that whole thing. Which realistically could be it, because it is a rebooted universe, just like the upcoming Mortal Kombat 1 is going to be a rebooted universe, where clearly they're playing around with established lore and things, so who really knows? Uh, either way, though, I don't really care. Um, I'm just super hyped. I'm a fan of Katana. Uh, every time I've talked about Mortal Kombat, I think I've made it very well known that Melina is my absolute favorite character. So, you know, whatever. Uh, I like Katana enough, but there's that rivalry. So I'd be interested to see if it plays out or not. But who knows what their direction here is. I'm just glad that we are going to get Katana in this. And uh, she's going to be played by an actress that I actually do like, that I've seen in a bunch of things. So kind of cool. Uh, it looks like they're rounding out a pretty decent cast. So I'm excited to see uh, who else is going to get added and just what they do with their costumes. Because let's be real, Katana's costume is pretty simple. You can't really screw it up, I would hope. Yeah. Let's hope they don't screw it up. Um, but hey, I mean, at least this person is not, uh, per I, mean, I mean, at least this person is not a, a you know, person of color. You know what I'm saying? So, because, um, yeah, on that last Mortal Kombat, I don't know why they race swap Melina. You know? I mean, because Melina is like an Asian chick, you know? So, Sandy Lakatana, Asian, you know? So, I don't know why they have like a person of color playing that character of Melina. But, um, yeah. Like I said, man, like. <laughs> That first Mortal Kombat, man, on, in 2021, it was just a mess. I can't believe they screwed that up. Because, I mean, and, and the sad part is, I waited so long. So long ever since the uh, Annihilation. That came out way back in 1997. So, I don't know how long that's been. I mean, it's been years. Years. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. Like, come on. Like, this is what y'all give us, you know what I'm saying? After all these long years, you know, like, I'm trying to, like, 
Let's see, 1990, what was it? 1997 came out. I mean, that's kind of like 20 years, ain't it? 21, 22. Yeah, about 24 years, probably. Yeah. I don't know if I got that right, but like, it's been, like I said, it's been that long, you know what I'm saying, until they screwed that mug up. So I hope they do justice with the second one, and I hope they don't try to just do race swapping, you know what I'm saying? Just don't do no race swapping. Like, just don't. It's just not going to work. Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. I don't know. Let's just hope they do right this time, man. I really do hope. Because it, they just been screwing it up. <laughs> they really just been screwing it up. But anyways, post your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think, man. Um, you think are you uh, are you satisfied with the actress that's gonna be playing that's the Katana character? I mean, are you happy about it? Sad about it, mad about it? Let me know how y'all feel about it, man. I really want to know how y'all feel about it. And um, if you enjoy my reaction, make sure you hit that like button. And always subscribe it and share it. And I'm going to catch you guys later. Deuces. Damn, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs>